All I want is champagne and sunshine Looking for a good time Sipping on the stars while we laying under sunlight Tan skin and light eyes Oh my, she's so damn fine Kissing on the night We be running from the night time Oh my gosh, this car is making so hot after rev the car or else you'll hear the idle. Yeah, I don't know if you'll hear the idle, but after rev it's a little bit. But anyway, where's this scene everybody? By the way, I want to know if y'all understand what I say at the start of my videos. Because I say where's the scene as in what is the scene? I'm from Trinidad, so it's like a slang of saying, Hey, what's up? How you doing? Hey, guys! <laughs> um, yeah, it's, it's basically a greeting. It's just a little slang that we like to say. Well, I like to say it, right? So, something that's been running through my mind lately, and I was like, you know what? I don't usually, more or less, I'll just, you know, talk about stuff that are, you know, fitness related so like you know let me just pick up the camera and talk about what's on my mind and every neighbor that pass I feel like a weirdo when I do this <laughs> listen I just want to say like this entire bodybuilding kind of lifestyle don't do it to be appreciated by others don't do it to be accepted by society because you're basically just setting yourself up for some serious disappointment yes you're gonna look a lot physically appealing but trust me they're gonna get the will 
of haters. People gonna have a bunch of shit to say. Like, for instance, apparently, what happened, Carissa? Why are you coming inside here? I'm coming inside just now, Carissa. Leave me alone. What are you doing? Nothing. Leave me alone. Why? <laughs> I'm going in Zerd and record this so nobody will harass me. As I was saying, apparently I'm vain and conceited. Bro, what the hell? There's no win-win in this world, right? Before, when I was basically, how I like to put it, skinny fat, people, you know, would have the meanest shit and things to say. And back then, I used to lash out on every single person. I used to cuss other person if they ever tried me. I used to get in fights in school. And then later down the road, I started to, you know, realize that, dog, people gonna have negative shit to say about me forever. So, where's the sense of beating up myself over? something that is unpreventable you get where i'm coming from at first i know a lot of people get into the gym just to be you know a lot more physically appealing but for us fellas yeah it's gonna have gills out there that like oh uh, you have some real nice arms and he real buff and nice but <laughs> Any lifter can relate to me. First of all, when you start gaining some size, the gender that's gonna have most compliments and feedback from is uh, mostly men. And if you don't believe me, look on every male fitness YouTuber comment section or a male fitness Instagram superstar comment section. It's only niggas, though. But back to not being able to please everybody. Basically, people. Well, people close with me that I don't really associate myself with, I get. As I've been saying that I'm vain, I'm full of myself just because I started getting a little muscle and I always in the gym and I have no time for nobody. Maybe I don't talk to you that much because your presence is not healthy for me. I don't want you in my life again. I haven't changed one bit. The only thing that has changed is my physical appearance. So don't go in the gym thinking that people are gonna love you more. Some girls gonna say you're too big. <laughs> Other girls, yeah, they wanna start to touch up the arms when they see the arms hugging the sleeves. They wanna feel up the abs, the little chest gains. And well, fellas, if they have any negative shit to say about you it's majority of the time about your physique but all my lifters out there i know you all can relate to me on this the first thing they will ever tell you just to piss you off just to tease you is don't skip leg day like bitch you didn't even go to the gym i mean i have small calves and stuff like that but i know i'm lifting and i'm trying to better myself other like you trying to put down other people it, it it's just ridiculous all people always trying to put you down every single day when i was basically skinny fat it's oh you have man boobs and stuff like that and you need to get to the gym and get fit and then after when you actually get fit is oh he thinks he's all that he thinks he's the best he's so full of himself so what the hell now you see where i'm coming from there's no win-win you need to do this for yourself eh? you need to go to the gym because you're trying to better yourself you're not going to the gym to get gills you can get gills as a skinny person you can get gills as a fat person <laughs> you can get gills as a buff person Okay, confidence is everything. Yes, you will gain a little confidence when you look at yourself in the mirror every single day and you're pleased with how you're looking. You're gonna be confident in yourself. This is why I'm like, okay, yeah, you should go in each other. There's a possibility that your confidence will increase, but it all draws back to doing it for yourself. I always say this, if I was in the gym just to get girls or to fit in society, I would not be lifting as long as I have been right now. It's two and a half years I've been lifting right now. The heating just gets a lot worse as the years goes by. I even quoted this in one of my recent Instagram posts. 
you're literally committing mental suicide if you're trying to fit in you will never ever fully fit in. i wasn't put on this earth to please anybody except god it's all about doing it for you go to the gym because you want to actually have a healthier lifestyle you want to feel comfortable in your own body if you're not happy with your own body not because of what society says or because of what you see in the mirror and you know personally that you want to get a better body do that go to the gym as some kind of stress reliever but never <laughs> never go to the gym to be socially accepted because you're gonna be disappointed at the end of the day you're gonna feel puzzled at the end of the day because you realize you're getting nowhere sometimes the closest set of people to you have the most negative shit <laughs> to say about you so why do you think in a little muscle you'll be socially accepted even when people closest to you that know who you really are still have bad shit to say about you so those that don't know anything about you easily talk trash about you oh yeah and i almost forgot to say for the people on instagram that thinks i'm so vain because i post a lot of pictures of my body well it is a fitness page for y'all that think i'm going the extra mile by creating a youtube channel well it is a fitness youtube channel so don't expect me not to show my physique once in a while it's a fitness page you idiot Oh, 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 oh.